Hey guys, Allison here. I want to talk to you today about the importance of believing your own eyes and listening to your inner voice, trusting your gut. All right, we're seeing this play out in our society now. We see the mainstream media standing in front of a burning city telling things are mostly peaceful. There's a lot of misinformation, disinformation out there today. And I think it's really imperative that we all take a step back. You know, we all have our own beliefs, we all have our own agendas, but I think we need to really evaluate things very clearly. And really, what do you see with your own eyes is really, really important to look at. Not just what other people tell you, doing the research, right? And what does your gut tell you? Now, the reason this is important is that I think that this translates into relationships as well. You know, I've worked with people in abusive relationships over the years, and that's kind of the hallmark, this kind of control, this manipulation, the gaslighting, don't trust what you see, trust what I'm telling you, um, the manipulation. And I think it's super important that we always like say, okay, what is my inner voice telling me? Now, how do we get in touch with that inner voice? Folks, you need time to be quiet. You need time in prayer. Prayer before the Blessed Sacrament is one of the greatest things that you can do in terms of just being in the presence of God, being in the presence of truth itself. And also, to be honest with ourselves, when we have very strong desires, we can, we're easily manipulated because we feel very attached to those desires. So let's say somebody really wants a relationship to work out. The evidence may start to pile up that this person's not a good person or not treating you well or not being honest with you. So I think, like I said, I think I see what's happening on a, a global scale is really what happens on an individual scale on a microcosmic level in relationships. So it's so very, very important to take a step back, find a trusted person you can talk to to talk things out. I think it's also important to be doing an examination of conscience and going to confession. So that we, you know, sometimes we really want something, we don't want to believe something about somebody or, you know, we're just easily manipulated there. So believe your own eyes. And I think particularly with everything going on politically, we're going to go through a lot more disinformation from every side and a lot of manipulation. So take a step back. We really, really, really need to be in prayer right now and listening for God, waiting on God and trusting that inner voice because that's where God speaks to us in our hearts. And same thing in relationships, if we're really, really honest. And that's, I think, a grace that we can pray for, the grace to be honest with ourselves, to be able to see the truth. And we pray for the grace and the power of the Holy Spirit in our lives. It's so, so important. Hope you find that helpful. Make sure you like and share the video, and I look forward to talking to you soon. God bless you.